Hi guys, welcome back to my video and today we will be reacting to In the Middle by Natalia Barbu, which is Moldova's 2024 entry. I am, I have no expectations. I've not listened to any of the songs in the national final. I'm excited because obviously Natalia Godienko represented Moldova a few years ago and she slayed. So if we've got another Natalia for Moldova, that gives me hope. <laughs> I don't know. In the middle gives me gal bop, maybe. I don't know. But then we had In the Middle by the Mammies from Sweden. So, yeah, I, I'm i excited. Um, but before we dive in, make sure you like, subscribe and comment and all of that jazz. I think I need a beat for that now. Like, all that jazz. <laughs> I'm so fucking annoying. Oh, oh my god, they all look identical. Ooh, okay. Do you know what this is giving me? Have you ever seen that TikTok challenge? I'm gonna just have to pause it. You know that TikTok challenge where people are singing and like you have to guess which one's singing and the other one's are miming? It's giving that because the girlie in the back looks like she's singing it. <laughs> mm. I'm loving the outfit. And I like that the LED, you know, it's very dark. And I've already got that aesthetic, you know. It's gonna be like quite moody, Evie. Ooh! This is what I want for Moldova. It's quite similar to that entry last year, La Luna by Pasha, but I'm not complaining. I do get a little bit lost with the verses, but when the chorus hits, it's, it's giving. Vocals. And I love the instrumentals in this chorus. Do you know what I want? I think because the song seems quite dramatic, I want that portrayed on stage as well. Okay, some choreo, some clapping. You know what? It's very slick, isn't it? Like, nothing's not on point. Oh my god, that was so conty the way she just got it. <laughs> Ooh, is that like a clown in the back? Mm, some violence, girl. I really want to know what this song is about because the LEDs, it seems quite deep. Oh my god! Natalia, your voice, bitch! I love this like operatic feel. Wow, Moldova. That ending, the operaticness. I know Jordan Davis is going to love this. Actually, shall I text her? Oh, shall I send him a voice message? Right, where is he? Jordan, I'm just filming my reaction, so this is going to be in a video. <laughs> But a bitch, you're gonna love Moldova if you've not reacted already. There's some operaticness that you're gonna vibe with. If I'm being honest, the verses are a little bit disappointing, but the chorus, oh, the F now, oh, 
you know, it's not like I feel like I'm on holiday. It's that, da, 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 you know, oh, and when she gets the violin out and the way she gets out, it's so in sync with the back and singers. Like, it's very thought food as performance. Mm, Moldova. Like, Moldova's a, a powerhouse in your vision, and I always think they're very underrated. But they're a powerhouse. Like, they've qualified the last few years, like, non stop. And can we appreciate our TikTok viral galley, Moldova 2016, Lydia Isaac with Falling Stars? She was robbed. Um, I don't know how this will do with your vision. But then Moldova said something quite similar to this last year, and they qualified easily. So I feel like that might happen again this year. But I know that I want to be in the middle as, yeah, I can get behind this song. The more I listen to this, I'm going to like it. So Moldova, well done! Um, let me know what you think in the comments of Moldova's entry. And make sure you Follow me on Instagram at Luke Griffiths underscore 20. Just if you want to get to know me more. If you don't, okay. I won't take it personally because I'm an annoying bitch. <laughs> but yeah, make sure you tune in for my next video. Bye, guys.